Now, how biased is the establishment media? Well, it's one thing for conservatives to call out the obvious hatred for Trump in the media, but quite another when the same point is made by a guy who's a member of the legacy media and has been for decades, longtime host of ABC's Nightline and now a contributor on CBS News, Ted Koppel. I'm terribly concerned that when you talk about the New York Times these days, when you talk about the Washington Post these days, we're not talking about the New York Times of 50 years ago. We are not talking about the Washington Post of 50 years ago. We're talking about organizations that I believe have in fact decided as organizations that Donald J. Trump is bad for the United States. But the notion that most of us look upon Donald Trump as being an absolute fiasco, he's not mistaken in that perception, and he's not mistaken when so many of the liberal media, for example, describe themselves as belonging to the resistance. It is likely only because Koppel is 79 years old and in semi-retirement that he has the guts to call out the transparent bias of his compatriots in the establishment media. But rest assured, he will be scorned for it.